The Senate Committee on Trade and Investment says the 10th National Assembly is prepared to give the necessary support to all agencies of government in order to boost their performance. Chairman Senate Committee on Trade and Investment, Senator Marwa Ibrahim Sadiq, gave the assurance in Abuja during a courtesy visit on the Nigerian Export Promotion Council to ascertain performance, challenges and the way forward. A business correspondent, Ile Meje, tells us more. While acknowledging that the visit is a good opportunity to brainstorm with the council and to intervene in the yearnings of the people on issues in the trade and export ecosystem, Chairman of the Senate Committee on Trade and Investment, Senator Umar Ibrahim Sadiq, affirmed support of the 10th National Assembly to promoting export. This visit will afford us the opportunity to rub minds on the challenges, concerns, and problems that the agency is confronted with in the course of project implementation. We want to assure you that this committee will ensure that the council receives its pride of place and will be encouraged through proper legislative interventions to deliver on this mandate of meeting the expectations and yearnings of Nigerians. The 10th National Assembly, in particular the Senate Committee on Trade and Investment, is committed to transparency, accountability, and good government. Speaking in an interview with Newsmen, the Executive Director and Chief Executive Officer of the Nigerian Export Promotion Council, NEPC Mrs. Nonye Ayeni, and the Vice Chairman, Senate Committee on Trade and Investment, Senator Olubi Fadei, emphasized on formalization of trade to increasing the volume of foreign exchange. Realize that the export, the figures that we get is a far cry from the volume of non oil export exported out of this country because a lot is happening at the various borders and corridors. So what we've done, we're working with the major stakeholders in those corridors and the borders to see how we can formalize this trade, trying to address their challenges. And two things are important, how we can capture data so that we can bring it to the mainstream and how we can formalize the trade to increase the volume and value of our exportable product and this will also increase the volume of foreign exchange that comes into the country. Yeah, apparently we forward is to support them, you know, to change some, make some law, you know, which they requested for, and uh, we, you know, when we get back to selling to get into this act of law to support them, and also to be able to generate their own revenue, which they requested for, which we could support them in the Senate. It is hoped that the enhanced support of the National Assembly to the Nigerian Export Promotion Council will help to strengthen the export procedures and processes across the nation. Ile. Image, Aso Television News.